Warriors tonight. Get a little, little rest before the playoffs begin next weekend. Shade, too strong, gets his own rebound. Didn't even hit the deck. In the air, put it low past. Edwards, Edwards went flying, but it wasn't a foul call because he didn't have his arm extended. Just strong. Save and lead, Garza puts it up and in. Garza. Edwards, recent pickup for Detroit, has been quiet so far tonight. Hits that jumper. Skip pass, Matisse Stavel, corner three is good. Looking bucket from Batista. Magruder looking to go coast to coast. Tough shots. Garza the rebound and the putback. Uh, with a guy like Garza, if you just throw it up there and it wasn't above the rim, so he couldn't just flush it. He had to do something with it. He couldn't create. Pick it for three. Got ourselves a one-point game. Picks it from the line. Tyrese Maxey having a sensational sophomore season. Anticipate the contact here. The Pistons are going to grab and hold and be aggressive. Got to play through that. Shake does just that. 26. Pippen <laughs> I was 20. Still a lot of ball to play. 27 now for Shake. He absolutely exploded. Put it together. Playing with five fouls. Got to be careful. of 16, yeah. you mentioned the 9 of 11, that's efficient. Looking for more, and he's got it! Another two-handed rim rocker for Paul Reed. Serving him up is Shake Milton. Well, we talked about the nice connection between uh, Tobias Harris and DeAndre Jordan. Got a nice one brew between Shake and Paul. Another steal. Corkmaz, skip pass to Joe. Bible for three. Good movement, good look. And Magruder, that's going to be an offensive foul, isn't it? No. Nope. Uh, it looked like Shake was set, but that's okay. So, uh, no, but I agree with you. It did look like an offensive foul. Maybe he, maybe he just went down so hard. He might not have been in position. It happened so fast. So let's take another look at the defense first. Foul on Milton. Coming right at you. Got there a little late. There's, there's contact there. Yeah. Not a lot, but enough. First on Shake, just the second team foul of the quarter. I don't know if I should should talk. Did I jinx it last time? <laughs> don't jinx it. I mean, look. I'm thirsty. Tyrese wants it. Everybody wants it. Everybody at home wants it. The greater doesn't want it. Sorry, Tyrese. Just selfish minded. That's okay. I bet Tyrese would buy us frosties if we were in a one. He would. I think he would. Yeah, he's a really nice guy. Shake wood, too. No good on that jumper. It's a good look, though. Pour it down and continue to play your game, right? Move, keep the clock moving. No fouls. Blocked by Thibel. I hit to shake. Milton. And that's going to be a goal tag. We have a final. We have a final in the G League Eastern Conference Finals. How about that? Way to go, Coach Carl and the Blue Coats. Miles Powell, who we saw briefly before the start of the new year, led the way with 34 points. Way to go, guys. Made it into the best of three G League Finals. Garza. Big boy. <laughs> that's, all, that's all I got to say. He is a big boy and he plays like a big boy. He's got a double double tonight. He's got 15 and 10 now. Two and a half to go. Regular season finale. The dish from Thibault to Paul Reed. 23 for Bebo Paul. The lead 15. 
feel like this is when we should bring up the Doc Rivers. If the Sixers were able to hang on to this victory tonight. Would pass Rick Adelman, your former coach, move into ninth all-time in head coaching victories in the NBA. Call Reed the rebound, and this would also be win number 100 as head coach of the Sixers for Doc Rivers. Remarkable. The longevity. And people say, oh, all you got to do is just hang around long enough. You'll win enough games. Yeah, but not everybody gets to hang around long enough unless you have the confidence of your employers. It's not that easy. Both Mons reset three. Off the front of the rim. Reed, the offensive rebounds. Paul Reed, have a night! Crowd on its feet. Bench loving it. A career high 25 for Paul Reed. You can see the desire in his game. He wants to impress so badly. A guy who just gives it his all. Look at this. Out hustling three Piston defenders with the extra hustle on that play. And they're chanting for Amala. That's a b-ball palm chance. That's got to feel good. Well, we know that this crowd and these fans have been wanting to see him. We know that, as you've explained multiple times, the G League very different from the NBA. But it is great to see him get some run here in the final game of the regular season for the Sixers. Absolutely, and all that hard work is getting rewarded. You want to keep giving him incentives so he continues to perform for you. Garza, the tough fade 